favourite memory. Oh, there's lots of memories, but um, I've got a, a Year 12 class that uh, is in this room, actually. There's a group of girls that sit up the back left, which annoy the hell out of me, but I do really enjoy the gossip they always <laughs> could be keeping secret. My favourite memory would have to be when uh, Tanvir forgot her workbook in year 9, so I gave her a blank piece of paper. Later on that day, I was walking around the school, saw a bit of rubbish, thought being the good citizen I am, I'd pick it up, and um, yeah, it was Tanvir's work. Um, Any time that I have a day where I don't see my year 12 class or I don't see my year 12s is not a good day. Today is one of those days and I miss them. I've obviously got so many. Um, meeting everyone in year 7, um, following them always through to year 11. No, to be honest, it's just every day I am just going out and seeing everyone. Even if I was having a bad day, I'd just walk around the school and automatically just one conversation would just brighten up your day and you think this is why you guys. Probably the extremely bad karaoke of um, My Heart Will Go On when we study Titanic and Elective. Oh, Dash, I'd have to say probably your photo day, but the afternoon when you guys got to, I suppose, express yourself and enjoy yourself and just actually seeing how much you actually liked being with each other, you actually were so happy and enjoying that moment, it really sort of solidified for me how much of a special year group you guys are. You know, things are pretty sorted and they're under control now until I hand the assessment task back when I'm confronted by one of the finest students I've taught in a while who's holding a blue form and is going to drop the subject because she only got 23 out of 25 and came second. I'm here to tell you, Generation Z, that you are a pretty high maintenance crowd. My favourite memory with my Year 12 model class is every time we have done some kind of interactive simulation activity and they really get into it. Um, so whether it was Ben putting on um, an outrageous Russian accent in Year 11 uh, or Lexi and Abby pretending to be French when we were um, reenacting the Treaty of Versailles, that was hilarious. And my favourite memory with society and culture would have to be recently um, when they came up with proposals for Bollywood films and they got very excited about their proposals. My favourite memory of Year 12 is every single conversation with Adve Hassan. Uh, worst thing, definitely trying to get my Year 12 Business Studies class to actually talk about the work and not about their weekends or scam hunt or this or that. The most annoying thing about being a Year Advisor is probably the drama. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm here to support you all, but I forgot how much teenage girls love drama. So what do you think is the most annoying thing about the fighting Year 12? Um, probably them using B15 all the time. When it rains, when it's sunshine. Most annoying thing, this is a tough one. Um, it's probably not knowing you guys enough. I think it would have been a really awesome journey to sort of know you guys from the start of high school. What is your proudest moment? Uh, that'd be at one of our holiday mentoring study sessions when I took Noah Keese out playing pinball to seal victory for my team. And in my year 12 class in this group, and we, we do the stand up, but they do so well, making me very proud. See you guys graduate. Yeah. See you from year 7, come year 12, and then going out there to be involved in My best piece of advice would be to do something that makes you happy. Don't choose a dog for the money because, yeah, money's not everything. Um, I think it's really important to you know, be brave and put yourself out there and don't say no to experiences because it's the most important thing. What's the best piece of advice you'd give to the five year old? No matter what you think, your parents know more than you. Listen to them. What is your best piece of advice? Uh, people are going to disagree with you sometimes and that is okay. You don't have to be personally offended by someone with a difference of opinion. My best piece of advice is to keep looking out for each other and keep being kind to one another. Um, because even though you all pretend to be mean to each other, um, and like when Millie told Helen that she belonged in the bin, um, I know you all are really supportive and that's so important as you go through life, um, having people to look out for you. Final question, what's the best Just Dance song? Waka Waka! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah.
go for the night That would be the best therapy for me Five years from now when you're in year 12, what advice would you like to give your older self? Be smart. What do you want to say to yourselves, uh, your year 12 selves who are about to graduate? Have fun. <laughs> you made it. Yeah. You survived high school. Yeah, good luck on your HSC, get a good HR, don't stress about your HSC. Yeah. Who do you think is the cutest boy in your year? Oh, oh. <laughs> Who was your first high school crush? Olivia Tom Max. Olivia Harvey. Jacob. Robin. Tegan. Olivia Harvey. Charlotte Mathlon. Emily. Francesca. Synapse. Thatcher. Robin Jones. <laughs> Chloe. Romain. Charlotte. Mine was Ella. Laura Henderson, I reckon. I think it was Kayla. <laughs> Aiden Gosha. Tegan DeWilson. Wilson. Abla Franklin. Kayla. Connor McCary. Tony <laughs> Shaw. Casey. Caitlin Thatcher. Tegan Wilson. Thomas. Who was your favourite teacher and why? John Wright. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Sawyer, Miss Ruth, Miss Bass, Miss Shakur, Miss Abbacker. My favourite teacher. Flip the camera, Miss Tudden, <laughs> my guy. Miss oh, Adas, Miss Knopf, I think Miss Marish. Yeah. Oh, Miss Jenkins, Miss Kenna, Miss Tudden, Miss Chapman, yeah, Miss Jenkins, Miss Kenna, Miss Boss, Miss Bakudas, Miss Golding for sure, Mr. Chunk, no Jackie, Miss Connell, and Lindy Jones. What's your best <laughs> high school memory? Water fight. The boys rave during the swing carnival. The athletics carnival. Being done with trials. My cup in the footy game was fun. Scab. Oh, Drew. Pro piss, poor kid. 